Hello everyone, my name is Shaban Ibrahim. I am working as a functional consultant. So today we will start a second session for general lecture configuration. So please share and subscribe to my channel in the <coughs> sorry in the previous session I implemented this functions. We already implemented in next in previous uh, session create legal entity, create number of sequence, chart of account, main account, main account category. Please make revision for the previous session. So today we will start from uh, financial dimension. So let's start. Let's see how to to create the financial dimension. So I will go to chart of account dimensions financial dimensions. I will make new see here there is two types for the financial dimension one is uh, custom dimensions and the other is sub ledger or the standard dimension it comes from another modules so let us see we will create custom dimension suppose I will create vendor group Then I will go to save it. Then I will go to dimension value. Here I will add the dimension value. Suppose we tell vendor group 01. This is the ID. Here I will mention vendor uh, or internal. Then I will create second. VG to sorry external here there is some uh, criteria I must take out some parameter I must take care for this because it is very very important suppose the vendor group number two only I am working uh, he uh, it working only one month so let us say I will start from two 122 to 28 22 this is mean this dimension or this uh, dimension value it will work only one month from 1 February up to end of February here uh, suspend this is mean if uh, if I need this dimension value will not appear in the entries so I will make suspend so no one can make entry for this vendor group this is group dimension this is used in the consolidation group we will see later inshallah here don't allow manual entry suppose I need to stop entry for this account it will not appear in the general ledger video so, but you can make entry in sub ledger you can add or select in the uh, default dimension for sub ledger like account viewable, account receivable, uh, uh, other module. So if I make don't allow manual entry, so this is mean you cannot uh, select in the general ledger module. Okay. Suppose this is account is by uh, by default this account it would be shared for all this company. The financial dimension value it would be shared for for all this company. Suppose I I need to stop uh, entry or selecting this uh, dimension value from work one company so I will be I will go to legal entity override I will make add here I will see companies list all oh, this is all the companies so for example I need to stop entry and USMF company so I will make add here there is one option called suspend if I make suspend this is mean this is dimension value not appear in the USMF company so this is the first step how to add the financial dimension values I will mix it let us see another feature suppose I need to create VG A I will mention here it is like test here if I see the code, this is code content different uh, other 
كود اي دي ذا فورمولا اور ذا ماسك ات از ديفرنت هير اف اي سي ذير از تو كاركتر اند فور ديجيت هير يو ويل سي تو كاركتر اند فور ديجيت بات هير يو ويل سي ثري كاركتر اند لايك سيفن ديجيت سو هاو وي كان فيكس ذيس ايشو سو اي ويل كلوز ذيس وان هير ذير از وان اوبشن كولد دايمنشن فاليو ماسك You must add here two. For example, I need two two character. Let us say we will call V G, and let us see four digit. So I give to one, two, three, four. So there is uh, two character and four digit. So if I go to again to dimension value, I will create new. I will mention V G zero zero zero. Uh, four or three. Here there is no error. But if I change change the VG, suppose I add A, you will see error here. The dimension value does not match the dimension mask. So this is me. It is good uh, new feature and good feature to add mask to the dimension value. This is the way how to add custom dimensions. Suppose we need add standard dimension, you will select, let us say, uh, let us say, cost center, here if you, by default or cost center, but if it is exist here, we cannot uh, create another one. So let us say, select, uh, suppose, this is custom, because I created before, so suppose I create, select legal entity. If I go to dimension value, it is the same way. So here, you can not make duplicate for the uh, standard dimension. Okay. So here, if I go to, for example, I go to business unit or uh, let us see uh, project, and I open the financial or dimension value, you will see all project lists. So, but here you cannot add manual, you must go through the project management and the accounting module and create from there. Then it will come by default in the financial dimension value. Okay. This is mean. This is the way to, uh, the way to add the financial dimension. Okay. Second, I will show you how to create configuration account structure. This is the main thing in the uh, configuration, general ledger configuration. It is configuration account structure. I will go to, uh, I will make collapse all chart of account, account, sorry, uh, dimension, sorry, structure here, configuration account structure. Okay. Suppose I need to create new structure. Let us see. Uh, balance sheet. Account. Control C. Control V. Create. Here, the first segment, it is the main account. It is mandatory. We must create main account in the configuration account structure. Suppose I need add criteria. I am I mentioned here balance sheet account. So I will go to add new criteria. Sorry, I will remove this one. Here, there is main account. And it's like, no. It's between and Incorrect. Here I will mention from one to four. What means this? This is one. Uh, when I create the main account, there is one. It is called. It is there is one for the assets, not two for liabilities, three uh, owners equity, and for revenue. But if I mention between and incorrect, this is mean from one to four, but not included uh, after four, like four zero zero one, like this one. So. The configuration account structure it will start from one to four, but here it is only main account. 
Suppose I need to add another segment. Segment here it is mean financial dimension or cost cost center. I will add segment here. Let us see. I will select uh, department. Okay. Here in the department, I can select only one department, or I will leave the star. If I leave this one star, this is mean all department. It will be available in the entries. Let us uh, select one department. So I will make duplicate screen. Suppose I need in the department only one department. It will appear the in the entries. I will go to chart of account dimension financial dimension here I will go to department here the dimension value for example I need this one only so I will take this one copy and I will go here in the financial dimension of the department then I will save it I will apply suppose I need this department it will be mandatory so I will not select the blank value are allowed so I will make apply by the system I will make apply the system this is mean or mean account with the department I forgot to add apply here when I make s between and include I must mention apply if I if I forget this one it will give you all the mean account so I will mention here from 1 to 4 then I will make apply you will see here there is filtration in the main account from 1 to 4 and the department number 0, 0, 0 to 2 let us see a new segment the segment is business unit I will add segment as a business unit uh, if I leave this one it is blank this is mean all business unit it would be available in the entries so after I finish this entry or this setup I will make activate now it is activated now this is the way to how to add the configuration account structure then After you finish, uh, after you added the, the configuration account structure, so let us see how uh, the GL it will be after I make the configuration structure. So let us see, I will select one journal, you will explain how to create the journal, inshallah, in the next session. It is not good. Here the date. Here I will select the account. This is the configuration account structure. Suppose I will select this account. Here only uh, in the department I will see zero two two. This is what I made in the structure. Then here all the the account I will select. Let us see. I will select number six. Here you will see all the business unit because I mentioned all business unit. This is the account. This is the how the account structure uh, it will affect the general journal entries so we are finished now the financial dimension the account structure inshallah next, next session we will complete thank you i hope for you from everyone uh, to subscribe and uh, share my channel thank you